in this video we will rationalize the denominator of the given fraction so when we are rationalizing the denominator we will remove the square root sign from the denominator so in order to do this we have to multiply and divide it by the square root of 8 and then 4 multiply by square root of 8 is 4 square root of 8 and square root of 8 multiplied by square root of 8 is the square of square root of 8 now we can cancel this square and this is square root so we have 4 upon 4 square root of 8 upon 8 now how can we cancel this square root and this is square so in order to understand this thing we will evaluate this that is square of square root of 8 is equal to 8 so we know that square root of 8 means 8 raised to the power 1 upon 2 and whole power 2 so by the rule of indices these powers can be multiplied so we have 8 raised to the power 1 upon 2 multiplied by 2 and then we have 8 raised to the power 1 because we can cancel these 2's so 8 raised to the power 1 is equal to 8 so we can see that square of square root of 8 is 8 so we can directly cancel square root and square now again we can cancel this 4 and this 8 so we have square root of 8 upon 2 so now we will further simplify this square root of 8 by factorizing 8 so 2 4s are 8 and then 2 2s are 4 and then 2 1s are 2 so we can write 2 multiply by 2 multiply by 2 in this in the place of 8 so we have the square root of 2 multiply by 2 multiply by 2 upon 2 and then 2 multiply by 2 is 2 is square multiply by 2 under root upon 2 now we know that square root of a multiply by b is equal to square root of a multiply by square root of b so we can apply this rule over here and we have 2 square in place of a and 2 in place of b so this can be written as a square root of 2 square multiply by square root of 2 upon 2 and again we can cancel this square root and this is square so we have 2 multiply by square root of 2 upon 2 also this 2 and this 2 can be cancelled so the final answer is square root of 